Spanish closing arguments in Roberto Ortiz's murder trial happening today. Ortiz accused of killing MMA fighter Aaron Rajman in his home near Boca Raton in 2017. Police charged six people in a home invasion and deadly shooting. Josie Carbonari has been in court this morning and Josie Rajman's family has been waiting five years for justice. That's right, it's been a long time, and so a lot of people are waiting for the verdict to come out, hopefully later today. But Roberto Ortiz faces life in prison, and right now closing arguments are underway. First, the state will go, and then the defense will go. Each has an hour and a half to share their arg closing arguments. Now, um, over the last eight days, jurors have heard from numerous witnesses. They've heard different testimonies, including some from law enforcement. Um, and and also a little background, Roberto Ortiz is one of six young people police say was involved in the shooting and killing of 25 year old MMA fighter Aaron Rajman back in July of 2017. Court records show Rajman was dealing drugs from his West Boca home and was targeted for the marijuana and cash he had there. Ortiz was ultimately charged with one count of first degree murder with a firearm and two counts of home invasion robbery with a firearm. Today, 12 jurors must decide if they will convict him guilty on these charges beyond a reasonable doubt believe his actions were premeditated or if he acted in the heat of passion and manslaughter isn't off the table yet either once closing arguments are done jurors will have deliberations before a final verdict can be handed down